Hi bro, what are your thoughts on having owner and essential occupier scheme? This is something actually that not many people know. But when they know, they usually use this to buy two properties without paying ABSD. One person, one property. So they strategically plan when they buy the HDB, put under one person's name, put under the husband's name. And then the wife they put as essential occupier, not owner, essential occupier. But note that when you do this, the husband can only use the husband's CPF because he's the only owner. And the loan need to be based on just the husband only because he is the only owner. Wife name cannot use or wife cannot apply for loan or use wife CPF. Then no choice. HDB have to wait for 5 years MOP. After 5 years, now you can use the wife's name to buy your another property. You cannot buy HDB. One household, only one HDB. So use the wife's name to buy a private condo. Don't care better why one bedder, two bedder, three bedder. Bottom line is you can buy another property without paying ABSD. And this is how a couple or a family used this method to own two properties, one HDB and one private condo.